All right, Lana and Casey are in the greenhouse checking some stuff out, so me and Sailor are gonna go see what's up. And I put pigtails in Sailor's hair. First time I ever did it. Turn around, Sailor. Show me your pigtails. Let me see. Yeah. All righty. Hey, hey, what's going on in here? Well, we tried our first tea, me and Lana. Oh, cool. Well, let's see, let's try one too. Come here, Sayla. Whoop, go ahead. There you go. Oh, you were gonna have that one. It's okay. You got to try one, now Sayla gets to try one. I wanna eat this one. Uh, let's save that. Please. Believe me, these are the Mexico variety. The peas get so huge and it'll be so much better. Yep, we got lots of peas coming here. Now I'm gonna snack on some of these guys. I want one! You gonna eat it? Yes. Alright, let's see. You have to rinse it. I just want one. Yeah, we got uh, a Daddy, few that are ready spray here. Them. Spray them. Try them. These are the Matt's Cherry Wild. So they're little little guys, but they uh, they got a nice sweet flavor, and I even like them right before they're ripe too. And this is the bite. one that we uh, saved from the garden. It was just reseeding over the gravel where it was planted. So we pulled a few of the little seedlings, and uh, here it is today. There she goes. Go ahead, go for it. Is that good? Is that good? A little bit. A little too juicy. A little too juicy? I've never heard another that being a problem before. I want another one. Okay. You like those, Sayla? Me too. Ooh. I guess she's a tomato lover. She is. Awesome. Very cool. Okay, one more that's eatable and then we'll have more tomorrow. I hear cranes. Ah, uh, geese. Oh, the banana limbo. You oh did God. it. How does that song go again? There you go. Limbo collision. Ready, ready, ready. I'm going to go under this one. Go ahead. Go ahead, Sayla. Oh, my You cheated. Ready? Okay. Do 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 I'm gonna do this one. Okay, let's do that one. Here we go, ready? Do 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 good job. Almost Sayla, almost Well, they found a limbo stick. It's an old sunflower. Go ahead, girls. We have a bad mealy infestation on a lot of our succulents. And as you can see, they nibbled right through this. So it left this whole piece here off of this beautiful succulent plant. If you look really closely, you can see all that white stuff. That's a bad mealy bug infestation. Before we were using the organic Monterey for spraying and it was working, but I think everything's just becoming immune between the mealy bugs and the thrips. It's like now they're like, yeah, try to get rid of us now. So <laughs> I've been switching it up with something that I actually got last year and I totally forgot about it. It's called Trifecta. And um, we're gonna go ahead and mix some of this some neem oil, a little bit of soap, and we've been trying this combination 
in the spray bottle for Thrip and Mealy Bugs, and it's been working. We just did this yesterday, and when we came out here today, everything has died that we sprayed it on. We just had to spray it really wet and heavy on the leaves, and um, it worked. I think we're gonna have to start alternating between this mixture and the Monterey. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> you okay, Mama? Right, right there. there, right there. Hold it there, Sayla. Nice. Boy, it feels like we're living in Seattle. We got a lot of rain last night, and this is the waterway that runs along the side of our property. And one of the things that we are really wanting to do this year is get this cut into almost like a, a creek so that we don't have all of this water spillover that we have here. We've got a, a major issue up towards the uh, street and driveway there, which I'll show you. We're gonna try and cut a culvert into there and reclaim some of our garden space up front. An hour or so ago, this water was rushing through here almost like a river. It's subsided quite a bit. You can hear my feet sloshing. Got some ducks out here in our uh, our little waterway in the front. Hopefully I don't scare them off. There they go. So as we get closer to the street, you can see the, the flooding issue that we have, and that's typically where we plant, or we're planting a lot of our pumpkins and it just gets so wet over there, things don't do well. So this year, we wanna put a driveway that goes through here, all the way through there. So in order to do that, we need to put a culvert right there. So all the water's coming from a culvert right there, and you can see it all comes from the east and it kind of comes downhill through here. So if we can put a culvert right there, that'll take care of all of the spillage that happens around it. Coming back up here and there's Sayla. Those little ones are always watching. They're always watching. <laughs> 